There was a recent report uh, that I saw from Germany, and it showed that patients continued uh, there. It was a very small number of patients, but they continued to shed virus for one to two weeks after clinical recovery. Have, is this been your experience? Is this something you've seen, or is this something that uh, maybe occasionally happens and doesn't happen all the time? So, uh, Professor Wan, who do you think should uh, answer this question from uh, Professor Noman? Yes, please remember. Sorry, you have to uh, you have to turn on your audio before you start talking. But I think your the channel is on already. Yes, now it's can good. Can you hear me? Yes, it's okay. It's good. It's okay. Mm -hmm. You can proceed okay. with your answer. Yeah. Okay, and um, as you know, that uh, one famous doctor, doctor. Song Nan San uh, reported the, the same scenario at a media press. He found is that several patients uh, come back to the hospital to come back to the hospital to further consultation after they uh, they finished the seventeen uh, the the fourteen days quarantine after mm -hmm. discharge from. For the hospital, and we found the nuclear PCR test positive again, and so the patient was isolated again, and the epidemiological surveillance were performed again. They trying to uh, find the impact on others, but the conclusion is that the the, the patient has no contagious to others, and the, the similar conclusion has been found by some Hong Kong expert, they found, uh, they do some, uh, they do some viral culture and, f and there's no positive result from, from this uh, study. So maybe this phenomenon should tell us about there's still, maybe there's still some uh, viral virus segment inside of the patient body, but have no clinical uh, mean, meaning. Thank you.